What's up everyone, my name is Edward Lee. I'm a filmmaker and photographer. And in this video, we're gonna be unboxing the Lytra Studio. We're gonna be going over what comes inside of the box when you purchase it, um, all the bells and whistles and the features that it has, and also the additional accessories that you can use with this light. So let's not waste any time and get right into it. First, let's get into the items you receive with the light. In the box, you will receive a Lytra Studio light, a silicone diffuser, battery, quick charge adapter, a handle for the light, a setup guide, and the carrying case. Right off the bat, the Lytra Studio is the best in its class with a 97 CRI and TLCI rating and an impressive 3000 lumen constant output and 6000 lumen flash. This means that this light is not only bright, but also color accurate. Now, the most exciting thing about the Lytra Studio is the ability to have an infinite amount of colors in such a small, rugged, waterproof form factor. As a hybrid studio light, this light can be used both in the studio and outdoors. Now, let's go over basic operation and the features the studio has. To power on the light, all you have to do is hold down the power button on the back and you will see the Lytra logo indicating the light is powering on. Once you are on the home screen, you will see a few options. Let's talk about the light modes. First, you have CCT. In CCT mode, you have fully adjustable bi-color lighting between 2000 and 10,000 Kelvin, which allows you to create vastly different cool and warm scenes from winter to deserts, and for the Game of Thrones fans, from the wall to Westeros. It also includes a green shift control to match ambient lighting so you can optimize for blue and green screen shooting. There is also overdrive mode. Overdrive mode allows you to take the max output of 2400 lumen and push it to 3000 lumen for five minutes. To turn the overdrive mode on and off, all you have to do is press and hold the select knob. HSI mode lets you control hue, saturation, and intensity for a precise color choice. Gel mode allows you to pick a commonly used gel color with a tungsten or daylight light source. RGBWW allows you to have a full control of each channel or color. Now, for the effects mode, filmmakers can really use this light to their advantage. The studio ships with out-of-the-box presets that you can use or you can customize your own. This mode is great for filmmakers who might not have the budget or set to pull off some of the same shots. To charge the light, you open the USB waterproof door and plug a USB-C cable in with a quick charge adapter. Make sure the door gasket is free from debris and make sure you press firmly until you hear a click to ensure that it is closed all the way. The door must be clicked shut to be waterproof. To remove the internal battery, release the door on the side of the light. The internal battery is removable, fast swappable, and rechargeable. You can also use the internal battery as a standalone power bank to charge your other devices or gear while you're on your shoot. Like all lights, the Lytra Studio will get warm when on high output for long periods of time. We recommend mounting the light onto a stand or a handle when in use. However, the light is designed with an intelligent thermal management system built in. If the light gets too warm, it will automatically lower output to 50%. In the rare occasion that it still gets too hot, the light will shut off automatically. The Lytra Studio is also flash and DMX compatible. The light has a flash mode to allow for camera flash synchronization for photography. To activate the flash mode, all you have to do is use the flash cable and then press and hold the center dial until the letter F pops up on the display. Then press and hold the dial again to deactivate flash mode. And with the Lytra DMX dongle, you can also have DMX control over multiple lights, which seamlessly integrates into professional industry standard gear. Another great feature of the Lytra Studio is the ability to set custom presets to fit your needs. Just set the light to your desired settings. Then press the P button, go to any empty slot, and press and hold the left dial to set the current light setting you can set up to 10 custom presets. One big feature of the Lytra Studio is that you can also control it with the Lytra mobile device app. To download the app, visit the Apple or Google Play Store and search for Lytra. 
Once the app is downloaded, make sure your device's Bluetooth is turned on. Next, power on the light. In the app, press the add light button. Then continue to follow the prompts in the app from there. In the app, you can see all the same settings as you would on the OLED display, plus even more. You can control the intensity of the light in each mode and full control of the settings. In CCT, you can choose between 2 and 10,000 Kelvin and also the green shift. You can toggle between the overdrive mode within the app. And in HSI, you can control the hue and saturation while looking at a color wheel. In gel mode, you can choose between daylight and tungsten and then a commonly used gel color. In RGBWW, you have full control of each channel or color within the app. And with the app, you can control the light and adjust the settings even if you aren't next to it. This is super helpful for any filmmaker or creator who needs to be farther away from the subject or from the set and being able to control their lights from a distance is super handy. The app also allows you to pair multiple Lytra Studios together by grouping them. To group the lights, all you have to do is add each light to the app, then assign them to the same group. Then you will see the option to control a specific group or all the lights at once. Blackout mode on the app allows you to turn off the light, essentially putting it in standby mode. Once you toggle the light on, it will turn on at the previous settings. You can also power off the entire light from the app instead of putting it on standby. However, once you power off the light from the app, you will need to manually power on the light from the hardware to turn it back on. You can also set favorites similar to custom presets by clicking the favorites button on the bottom and naming the current light setting. And here are a few care and maintenance tips. Make sure to use the included quick charge adapter to make sure the battery life is optimized. When cleaning the lens or the light itself, make sure to use a soft cloth so you don't damage the lens. And make sure to inspect the gaskets and close the USB door and the battery door securely before submerging it underwater. And do not run the light on high power, getting it super hot and then submerging it underwater. This could result in moisture entering the pressure valve. So who is this light designed for? This light is designed for those looking for professional studio lighting, but for those who also want something compact, durable, and on the go. In addition to these features, the Lytra Studio won't break your bank like traditional studio lights. The great thing about the Lytra Studio is that it can be mounted pretty much anywhere in the studio due to its small size. Whether you need to mount it to a stand, rail system, or handle, this light can go anywhere you go. The studio is great to use for interview lighting, key lighting, fill lighting, accent lighting, or even underwater lighting. You can use this light on set inside the studio or outdoors for a run and gun shoot in harsh environments. Even photographers can use this light to their advantage. The studio is perfect for portrait or product photography because it maintains a small footprint and has no cables to worry about. Last but not least, Lytra has also made accessories available specifically for the studio. First is the softbox. This comes with the accessory frame and a diffuser. This accessory is perfect if you're looking to get some soft diffused lighting. Second is the light modifier kit. That includes a softbox plus a honeycomb and barn doors. This kit will allow you to not only diffuse your light but also shape it. As I also mentioned earlier, they have available a DMX adapter to integrate into professional systems and a flash cable for photographers looking for flash synchronization. In conclusion, the Lytra Studio is a powerhouse light that can reproduce much of the same professional studio lighting scenes, but in a package that is portable, compact, and fits in your camera bag. It also can withstand any environment with its waterproof and rugged build. It is the most powerful RGB WW light per inch and per ounce on the market. The Lytra Studio allows you to have any color anywhere. So I hope you guys enjoyed that video of the Lytra Studio Light and maybe learned a thing or two about all the features it has and how it might fit into your workflow. Now, if you want to learn more about this light, be sure to visit Lytra.com. And if you aren't already, follow Lytra at Lytra Gear on social media. They're always posting about the things they're working on and how you can use their lights better. See you guys in the next video.